Hey everybody, it's Kathy, and in today's video, we're going to talk about what to wear instead of shorts if you are over 50. I've had quite a few requests from ladies that do not like wearing shorts because they either feel that they have thick thighs, varicose veins, chubby knees, there are countless reasons you have told me about why you're not comfortable wearing shorts, and you wondered what could I suggest that you could wear instead. Personally, I really enjoy wearing shorts, so some of the things that I'm going to mention I, I don't own, but I'll put, insert some pictures to give you some ideas, and I will also include in the show more or in the first pinned comment some different options at different price points. So even though like I might show something that might be a little more expensive than what you want to spend, I always do my very best to put a budget-friendly option if I can find one that will be flattering uh, in the comment section. So I think that dresses are really great for summertime. I wear a lot of dresses in the summer and I usually wear a dress length that goes just like above my knee or just below my knee. I don't like anything longer or shorter because I don't find it's flattering on myself. So I think a dress would be great. I'm five foot four so if I was looking for a maxi dress I would almost have to get like a petite maxi dress which can be difficult to find and I would look for a maxi dress for myself one that just it's not touching the floor it's maybe just you know touching the top of my shoe I wouldn't want anything longer than that for myself and for a midi dress I find that sometimes where they fall on me is kind of like where a capri would fall right in the most muscular part of my calf so with a dress like those are some lengths that I look for. I like a dress in the summertime because it's kind of like one and done. You don't have to worry about matching shorts and shirts and it's just so easy to pop one on. You get good airflow on those hot humid days if a breeze goes by. Also some other things I might suggest if you have a round face like me and if you have a large belly you might want to look for a dress that has like a scoop neck or a v-neck. Those are flattering necklines for myself. You might also like a dress that maybe has a little bit of a longer sleeve. This dress is from Talbot's. I'm okay with the the sleeve length that is a bit shorter than I think some of you might like, but if you don't mind showing your arms, this is a really cute dress for the summer and it has a nice little cutout in the back again where you can get the breeze going through and it just adds a little dimension to an otherwise plain back of a dress. And I also love dresses. Anytime I can get a dress with ruching and that's just a gathering of fabric, it just adds another detail to the dress and you know just makes it look a little more upscale. And you might opt for a print. That can also be flattering depending on the print that you go for. You really have to like find what works the best for you but a dress is a great alternative to shorts in the summertime. Another suggestion are ankle pants and I only really started wearing ankle pants this year. I'd never really given them much thought because I do wear shorts most of the summer or a dress. So I thought I'm gonna try ankle pants and you know what I really do kind of like them. An ankle pant is nice because typically the ankle is the slimmest part of the leg and if you can show some skin, it just helps to elongate the leg. Now, if I was wearing an ankle pant, I would probably wear a nude or flesh tone sandal that was had a more open top or even if you're wearing like a pump or a shoe, I think if you match your shoe to the color of your skin, and if the top is open as opposed to like winter shoes where you know they're closed on top that just helps to elongate the leg and make you look a little taller. The nice thing about ankle pants they're flattering because they just uh, help the leg to look like one long line so it helps us to look a little longer and taller and especially if you can add the flesh tone colored shoe that really helps to like elongate the leg. If you're enjoying my video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe. That really will help my channel out. Thank you. So the next suggestion I have for you is a skirt. I don't wear skirts like very often. I, I can't remember the last time I wore a skirt to be honest because I have a apple shaped body which means that I really don't have a defined waist. The moment that I put a skirt on it just brings attention to that area and it just cuts my belly in half and it's not flattering and if I'm trying to look slimmer that's why I opt for a dress or for shorts but I have come up with some suggestions for you if you're interested in skirts. 
You just want to be mindful of where the skirt falls. Again, you kind of want to try and stay away from the calf area because it is the most muscular part of your lower leg. And if the skirt falls there, it might make your leg a little more pronounced. A midi skirt might work if you are tall, but I know on myself at five foot four, with a 27 inch inseam, it's not the flattering length for me. So I might, you know, if I was wearing a skirt, I would get it hemmed. But if you're taller with a longer inseam, you probably will be fine. And if you opt for a maxi skirt, might I suggest that again, it fall like right on the top of your foot where your shoe is, or even, you know, a little shorter, like maybe just below the ankle. So you know how some can sweep the floor. I find that's just a little too much material and it can look a little overwhelming, but like a nice denim skirt uh, is always nice for the summertime. A maxi skirt. There's all sorts of beautiful skirts out there this year. And I feel like the maxi skirts, if you can wear them, they're in style with lots of beautiful, vibrant summer colors that are just gorgeous. My next suggestion to wear instead of shorts is colored denim. And this year was the first time that I bought myself a pair of colored denim. And I didn't know if they'd be flattering on me or not, but I'm actually quite surprised that they are fun to wear. And I bought this light blue pair and I can actually pair it up with a darker blue top if I want to create a more slimming look. Uh, there's so many vibrant, colorful jeans to wear. There's yellow, tangerines, pinks, blues, greens. So, so fun. And it's so fun to introduce some color into our wardrobe in the summertime. And if you really wanna have some fun, you can match your shoe color to go with your colored denim jeans. And if you want to elongate your leg, again, I would opt for a flesh tone sandal or a flesh tone shoe. And the final suggestion that I have for you instead of shorts for the summer are linen pants. I never really understood why people were attracted to linen. I guess because I live in a cooler climate, it's not something that's really popular where I live. But a few years ago, I bought a pair of linen pants from Old Navy and I wore them on a Caribbean cruise. And I have to say, I really understand now why people that live in the South love linen because it is a nice, cool fabric. It's breathable and it's not really that uncomfortable to wear in a hot, sticky climate. This year, I've also branched out and I bought a pair of linen shorts that I absolutely love from Talbot's. They're in different colors. I have them in indigo blue. And I also recently bought this linen popover top from Talbot's. I'm not in love with it because I feel like it's just not my style, but it's more the style and not the linen. I also last night saw this nice linen t-shirt from Chico's that I'm thinking of ordering. So I really like linen now and I can understand why people are drawn to it. And I will link a bunch that Old Navy has some, Talbot's has some. Uh, I'll try and find some at Amazon or Walmart also for more budget friendly options. But yeah, linen is really a great alternative for the summer and I'm really enjoying it. So if you're interested in seeing some more style tip videos, I will link my playlist for Apple Body Shaped Women. And thank you so much for watching my video today and I'll see you soon. Bye.